Victor Mansbridge, and this is The National. Potentials to toke? How one Mountie with a medical marijuana prescription has put the RCMP out of joint. I do have the legal right to, to smoke in, in my red surge. There's one fatality. Corporal Ron Francis has 21 years service under his belt, and in that time he's seen plenty of death and plenty of tragedy. I still am plagued uh, by flashbacks to this day uh, of wiping brains from my boot every time I see a black doormat. Uh, that's called a trigger. Francis also spent time in the Labrador community of Davis Inlet, where children were filmed sniffing gas. The work took its toll, and he was eventually diagnosed with post-traumatic stress disorder. RCMP didn't provide the treatment uh, for PTSD, and I, and I thank the RCMP for that. But Francis says he didn't find the treatment that helpful, so he went to his own physician, who earlier this month gave him a prescription for three grams of marijuana a day, about nine to 15 joints. The, the treatment works very well. Uh, keeps me very uh, on a level, uh, allows me to concentrate. Um, so uh, it works very well for me. The RCMP says it's okay with an officer using medical marijuana while on duty, but it reserves the right to limit an officer's functions, such as driving a car or carrying a gun. Francis is already on administrative duty, but the RCMP remains very concerned about the optics. Definitely a member uh, that has been prescribed medicinal marijuana should not be in red surge uh, taking his medication. Uh, it would not be uh, advisable for that member. It would not portray the right uh, message uh, to the general public. Uh, it's definitely not something that we would uh, support or condone. But as this home video shows, it is something that Francis has done. There is no policy that prevents me as a member of the Royal Canadian Mounted Police from smoking marijuana. I do have the legal right to, to smoke it in my red surge. That is not a conduct that is becoming uh, a, a person who wears that uniform. Uh, while he's in uniform, while he's on duty, uh, he should not be doing that. Tonight, the RCMP moved to make sure it wouldn't happen again. Officers visited Francis at home in New Brunswick and took away his uniforms. It was hard. Uh, you know, I broke down crying. Um, I was in a ball. In the floor. My sister had to come down uh, and console me. The Mounties missed the one uniform that the RCMP wanted most. Francis's iconic red surge was at his girlfriend's house, but he's been ordered in writing to hand it in by noon tomorrow. Evan Dyer, CBC News, Ottawa.